Hi, this is Kelly Wright at The Money Show, and joining me today is Mr. John Vandermost. I'm with Zach's Investment Research. You uh, have forgotten more about biotechnology than, than most people have ever known, and it's a fascinating industry. Um, John and I were talking off camera, and he, he just happened to mention something about, you know, when babies are born and they, they prick the heel, you know, they, they, they take these blood tests. Well, why, why is it? Well, they're searching for specific things. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, in your world, some of those specific things are, <clears throat> did the baby come out of the chute with something missing? Right. Okay. Right. And if they did, in your world, there's therapies to address those things. There are. Okay. Yes. And so... This can get really deep into the weeds, and you know, if, if if we're not careful here. But why don't we talk a little bit about gene therapy so that you know the you know the layperson can understand? Certainly. Yeah. Okay. Basically, how does gene therapy work? That's a great place to start. So, okay. gene therapy basically replaces a defective or mutated gene with the correct one. And okay. So when you come out, you're supposed to have this. Right, exactly. Yeah, you're supposed to have genes that give you all the, the proteins that, that make okay. your body function the way it should. Okay. And sometimes some of them are missing. And, and the example I, I like to use always is the bubble boy disease because I think okay. I think most people remember that mm -hmm. uh, and it's been in the works for a long time. It's called uh, Severe Combined Immunodeficiency, SCID for short. Okay. Uh, and it's been treated for a long time with gene therapy. Okay. So I think I, I like to use that example because it, it, it's something that everyone can relate to. But basically the babies that are born with that disease, and it's usually boys, uh, because it's X-linked, uh, it, 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 uh, X chromosome. X chromosome linked. Okay. Uh, they're basically missing a protein which allows them to to uh, have an immunity against you know common. Uh, uh, well, what common, allows you me to just walk right, around? Exactly. And be, I mean, we're mm -hmm. exposed to these things all the time, germs and everything. And, and if you have, if you're missing this protein, then you're not okay. able to protect yourself against it. So uh, you get um, you get assessed. And then uh, they do the test and they determine, okay, you're lacking this protein. All right. So we're going to prescribe this therapy. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. And then and the way these therapies work is uh, it's injected, ingested somehow. Sure, yeah. Okay. Usually it's infused in, in, into, into, your, into your bloodstream. Mm -hmm. uh, but there can be actually many, many ways it can be done. But the, the part that's distinctive for gene therapy is that it uses... Uh, a viral vector, which viruses have evolved over time to become they're, they're very, very effective mm -hmm. in, to get into our system and in, infect cells. And they in, viruses generally in, uh, in, inject into our cells their own viral material so that they can propagate. They're basically trying to survive just like any living creature would. Okay. Um, but what you can do, what the scientists can do, is actually change the, vi the virus uh, genome that's being inserted into the cells to whatever they want it to be. So instead of okay. the virus inserting its own uh, a genetic sequence into the, our cells, they put in the missing gene sequence or a corrected gene sequence for the one that's missing in our cells. So we're able to kind of hijack the viruses to our own ends to fix broken genes. <clears throat> this stuff is really smart. I yeah. mean, this is really, It blows really, my mind, too. <laughs> it's really high-level smart. So the, so these therapies are kind of like a search and destroy mission. They, it goes yeah, in. Yeah, right, exactly, searches, exactly. And, and, and it, remember that the, the genome is like billions of nucleotides long. I mean, yeah. if you stretched it out, it would be from here to, like, New York or something. That's a little bit of a ways from Dallas. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah that's, this is just <laughs> fascinating stuff. I could do this stuff all day long. Um, <clears throat> You should uh, go to Zach's Investment Research. You should uh, look at John's uh, stuff and what he does. Uh, it's at, yeah, scr.zax.com. There that's, you go. That's the place to go. There you go. Because <clears throat> this guy, like I said, he's forgotten more about this stuff than, than most people have ever known. It'd be <laughs> definitely worth your while. This is Kelly Wright at The Money Show with John Vandermost, and thanks for joining us.